Hey guys, welcome back to another celebrity inspired look. Today I am doing Becky G from her shower video and it was requested in my last celebrity look which was the Ariana Grande and so I decided to do it for you guys. Um, I think she is super cute and so I created her urban, fun, very youthful look. So I hope you guys enjoy the video. So I've been coloring my hair a lot and to help me with that I'm using the Riogeo Don't Despair Repair Deep Conditioning Mask and it just leaves your hair really soft afterwards and it helps with any damage and breaking like I have in my hair. And now that I'm out of the shower I like to use a moisturizer and today I'm using Beauty Without Cruelty. It's a sweet lavender hand and body lotion and I'm going to use that all over my body today. All right, so I'm gonna first start off with my favorite primer. It's the Bare Minerals Prime Time. Um, it gives you a little bit of coverage and smooths out your skin, uh, fills in your pores, so I really love this stuff. For foundation, I'm gonna use my Cover Effects uh, in G40, it's the Natural Finish Oil-Free Foundation. And I'm going to apply it with a, what kind of brush is this? The uh, Zoeva 102 Silk Finish Brush. If you've been watching my videos for a while, you know that I've been using this Cover FX foundation. I like the way it just covers everything and then it's it feels really lightweight, so it doesn't feel like you have a thick foundation or a thick layer of makeup on. For concealer, I'm using the Revlon Photo Ready in Light Pale, and I'm just gonna apply this to my under eye circles. I'm going to blend it upwards um, towards the cheekbones, towards the top of the cheekbones so that it acts as a highlight as well. So I'm going to also use this concealer as a highlighter, center of my brows and forehead, and then right here on the cupid's bow. It's going to give us a natural brightening effect. For the brows, I'm going to take my Anastasia Beauty Express palette, just using the darkest brow powder in the palette to fill in the gaps. And then I'm going to comb through them with the spoolie end of my brow brush. And to make sure that everything is even on my brows, I go back with a with the Cargo Brow Pomade and it's in the color dark. And I just fill in the areas that are still pretty sparse. And so once I do this, it makes them look pretty nice and even. To set my makeup and also help soften any areas I still need help with, I'm going to take the Be A Bombshell HD Powder and apply this with my Bare Minerals Full Flawless Face Brush. Today I'm going to start out with the crease and I'm using the Vincent Longo Luna Beach Shadow. I'm just going to take the taupe color at the top and wash that onto my crease. For the lid, I'm using the NYX Hot Singles Eyeshadow in the color Dress to Kill, which gives the eyes a nice pearly look, just like Becky G had in her video. Her eyeshadow look in the video is pretty shimmery. It does have a natural and fresh look to it. I'm just going to go back into that taupe color from the Vincent Longo shadow and deepen the crease area to add some depth. 
to the eyes and I'm going over with a pencil brush. And then with my Urban Decay Naked 2 palette, I'm using the color Foxy and I'm going to apply that to the brow bone. And this is a matte color because we do have a lot of shimmeries going on. And then for the inner corners, I'm taking Half Baked, which is that gold color, and I'm placing it right in the inner corners. Next, I'm taking the Jessie's Girl Liquid Eyeliner to give me a small wing like Becky has in the video. Next, I'm going to curl the lashes so that we can apply some mascara. And today, I'm using the Urban Decay Perversion Mascara and just going to apply generous coats to the top and bottom lashes. I was feeling a little shadowy under my um, eyes, so I took my Revlon concealer and went back over them, and then I used it as a highlight once again to down the bridge of my nose and the center of my forehead. And I know you probably aren't supposed to use a powder with on top of a concealer, or a concealer on top of a powder, but it works, and I felt a whole lot better afterwards. And after that, I applied my Anastasia Banana and Pink Powder over my um, concealer. And whew, I felt so much better after that. I felt a lot brighter and everything looked a lot better after that. And then I'm taking my um, contour color to um, contour my face. That just goes on the hollows of the cheeks, around the temples, around the forehead, down alongside the nose and under the chin. For the highlight today, I'm using the Bella Pierre Illuminating Bronzer in Peony, and I'm applying this with my Zoeva highlighter brush to the tops of my cheekbones and on the end of my nose. Then to give my face a nice warm glow, I'm using the NYX Sunkissed Palette, and I'm going to apply that behind the apples of my cheeks. To hydrate my lips, I'm using the Bella Pierre Pink Cheek pink cheek and lip stain and it's a stain but it's actually pretty hydrating and then I'm going to take my Hikari Cabernet lipstick and this stuff glides on really smooth and it dries matte or it, the finish is matte so it's a really nice lip color and it's perfect for the Becky G look. And for my nails, I'm using the Sally Henson Miracle Gel, and it's really cool because I usually get gels done in the salon, but now I get to do them at my house. I used Pretty Piggy. You don't need any lights for this, that's why it's awesome. Today I'm gonna use the Wrap Artist Nail Decals, and I'm gonna go ahead and apply them for you guys. I have my water and the decals, I'm just gonna cut some that I wanna use. So now I'm just going to take the decal and dip it into the water, leave it in there for about 20 seconds and then I'm going to place it on my pointer finger and you have this really cute decal, it's super quick and easy and I definitely think Becky G would try something like this. What do you guys think? Would you guys try this? And for today's fragrance, I'm using Harvey Prince Hello Fragrance and it has a lemon, lemony scent to it so it reminds me of summer so that's always nice to remember the summer but in my heart I am a fall girl and this scent actually lasts pretty much all day I'm at it I'm just gonna uh, and what am I doing here I'm putting it on the I don't know I'm going blank so what and um oh you need makeup. It black blocks. They're really important right now. Oh, my ear itches. Welcome to my little box here. I hope you enjoyed my video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. If you missed the last two videos, you can check one of those two boxes that you didn't see below. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, you can always do that by clicking there on that big subscribe button. And don't forget to read your guys' tweets. I always post my subscribers' tweets right here so you can check them out before you leave. And that's it. I love you guys so much, and I will see you in the next video. Bye, dollies.